Hi, my name is Tan Nguyen. I am a senior education manager at JPAL, and I'm also the program director for JPAL slash MIT's master's program in data economics and development policy. So the admissions process into the master's program in data economics and development policy at MIT is quite unique. Um, in order for students to be eligible to apply for the residential master's program, um, students have to first obtain their um, credential in the DEDP MicroMasters program. And that program is a series of um, three core courses and two electives um, that's online, it's self-paced. Um, students have to have completed that credential before applying for the residential master's program. And so when they apply for the master's program, um, along with the credential, they also have to submit the following. The first is a resume. Um, second is a, an essay or a personal statement. Um, the third is a research statement. Um, so in the research statement, we ask students to present a research topic that they would like to pursue. Um, we ask students to describe the motivation, the research question, and the uh, methodological approach. Um, also, the data they would use to answer the question, um, as well as how the study will contribute to the field of development economics. Um, we also ask for two letters of recommendation, although more is welcomed. Um, and then we also ask for transcripts. So unofficial transcripts are fine. Um, during the application process, but we do ask for official transcripts um, upon admission. And then for international applicants, we ask for the TOEFL and the IELTS scores. Uh, but waivers are available for those who have spent uh, four or more years studying in an accredited school um, or university where English is the primary language of instruction. And then in selecting students, uh, while we do review applications um, holistically and very carefully, um, we place strong emphasis on students' performance on the MicroMasters courses. Um, we found this admissions model has worked really well um, as it has allowed us to identify students who come from non-traditional backgrounds but are able to perform really well at MIT. So again, I would say um, the main differences in terms of the admissions process between the DDP program and many other master's program is our inverted admissions uh, model, um, where students have to have completed the micromasters credential uh, before applying for the residential master's program. Mm -hmm.